Do you want to get better at sports photography? Hey, my name is Travis Haydo. I am a professional photographer. I shoot a little of everything. However, I do love to photograph major events and sport is certainly one of my favorites. Right, let's get into it. Do you want to improve your sports photography? I have three pretty easy tips for you to make an impact immediately. And no, it has nothing to do with buying the best equipment. It is simply where you sit and your composition techniques. Number one, background. Your background is such an important element of your imagery. The background can either add so much to your image or it can completely ruin your photo. Notice where you're placing your athlete. Do you want to put the screaming crowd in the background? Or are you going for a super clean image to make it all about the athlete? I usually try to keep the background's exposure darker than my athlete's exposure. This makes your athlete pop from the backdrop and the image. Look at this image with branding in the background. And now look at this one where it is a super clean photo. Where does your eye go? Which is more aesthetically pleasing for you to look at. Number two, it's not all about the action. Look for the in-between moments. There is only so many images you can take of a cricketer coming into ball. This is a very re repetitive part of the game that looks the same after a while. What else can you capture? The cricketer throwing the ball up to themselves or rubbing the ball on their pants. What else can you capture that tells a story about the game or the event? Number three, one of my favorite things to do is to photograph into the sun. Basically, this gives you the texture when you shoot with the sun behind your back, it can flatten your image out. So I try to shoot mostly backlit stuff. The texture it creates with the darker side falling closer to you gives your image depth. I like to expose for the highlights when doing this, so you may find it seem a little underexposed, but you can fix this later on. For me, it isn't just capturing the action. That is certainly a massive part of it. However, you can excel by using your surroundings to amplify your imagery. Next time you're shooting, think about the environment and how it can add or subtract to your image. Hit subscribe, hope you learned something. See you next time.